In our previous video, we covered bracket orders. In this video, we'll discuss cross margin and isolated margin. Before we begin, let's cover the basic concepts of margin and leverage. Margin is the collateral deposited by the trader to cover the risk of your derivative positions. On DYDX, this collateral is held as USDC, displayed as USD on the platform as it's redeemable one-to-one -one for US dollars. Leverage gives traders the ability to increase exposure to a market by allowing you to take a position with a collateral level lower than the purchase price. Leverage is created by using your available margin. Leverage increases the potential reward for a trader, but it also increases the risk of loss or liquidation. The required collateral to open or add to a position is determined by a market's initial margin. You won't be able to open a new position or add to an existing one if this would cause your total equity to drop below the initial margin requirement. The collateral required to avoid liquidation is determined by a market's maintenance margin. If your equity ever falls below the maintenance margin requirement, your positions may be automatically closed. Your account's total margin requirement is equal to the sum of your margin requirements for each market in which you're invested. Profitable positions will offset losing positions within a cross-margin strategy, whether or not a profitable position is closed. Cross-margining is when an account holds multiple positions which share the same collateral. On DYDX, cross-margining is used by default, meaning that all of your positions relate back to the amount of USDC held within your DYDX account. As you open new positions in your account, this will impact the amount of collateral you'll be required to hold within your account. The opposite of cross-margin is called isolated margin. With an isolated margin, you can determine how much collateral to apply to any given position, and your risk is limited to the posted margin. If an isolated margin falls below the maintenance margin level, the position will still be liquidated, but it will not liquidate positions that are not secured by the isolated margin. In addition, with isolated margins, you can add to and remove margin from a position at your discretion. If you wish to create a position with isolated margin and leverage, you can do so by creating a new, separate account on DYDX associated with a different wallet. Let's take a quick look at DYDX and see how margin usage is displayed. From the Portfolio tab, you can see your margin usage expressed as a percentage, your free collateral, and your total buying power. From the trade screen, this information will also be displayed for each market. Since margin requirements are different for different markets, if I change from Ethereum or Bitcoin to another market, you'll see a decrease in available buying power for that market. If I add to my position, you can see that my equity stays the same, but my buying power decreases and my margin usage percentage increases. In this video, we covered the definitions of margin and leverage. We also covered the basic principles of margin requirements and how cross-margin differs from isolated margin.